A grassroots group of soccer lovers are celebrating tonight. Eight years after they saw at a higher level pro soccer team from Milwaukee, it is on its way. Michelle Fiore reports on the city's next professional sports team. Natalie and Jessup, good evening. Mayor Cavalier Johnson calling this a great day for Milwaukee, which will be home now to a team in the second highest level of soccer in the U.S. Their announcement was made right here where the new stadium for the team will be built. Raising scarves and popping champagne corks on an empty lot at the corner of Michigan and 10th. It started with five guys at a meeting at Oscars burger joint on 18th and Mineral or whatever. In 2014, Fred Gillich set out to bring higher level pro soccer to his hometown. And so it grew from five and we're like 3,300 strong on Facebook. Uh, we've got a solid, you know, uh, mailing list that are going to turn into season ticket holders. The same ownership that started the USL League One soccer team, Forward Madison, is now doing one better for Milwaukee with a USL Championship League team. The highest level in the U.S. is MLS, but USL teams can compete against them. And it's different than minor league because Milwaukee's USL team will play the Chicago Fire in the MLS, for example. And I promise you that we will do our very, very best to deliver a product on this field that the city is proud of. The announcement, a big one for Milwaukee, which expects economic growth from it. This flyover rendering shows where the new team will have a new stadium in the Iron District. The heart of the Iron District will be a, a soccer-specific stadium, uh, up to about 8,000 seats. And, and that'll be kind of the focus of the development. Around that will be hotel, housing, uh, music venue, other retail elements. Where the bars, restaurants, hotels, everyone's going to benefit from having this amazing entertainment district. It's a full professional league. Players start as young as 16, but most are between 20 and 30 years old. The stadium is expected to open in 2025, and they're asking the public to choose the name, logo, and colors of the team. The USL Championship League has roughly 25 teams right now. They're expected to add about 10 more teams to it in the coming years. Reporting downtown, I'm Michelle Fiore, CBS 58 News. Thanks.